Transversals, okay? Transversals is when one line, this red line, crosses two parallel lines. So line one is parallel to line two, and then the transversal is the red line. So if this was point A and point B, the red line is transversal AB. Now, transversals have certain uh, rules, okay? And we'll go to this top one here. Now, let's see if this makes sense. Okay. AB is parallel to CD. XY, the green line, is a transversal. Now, these angles right here where you see the little yellow slices and the little green dots, those are all exactly equal. Because AB and CD are parallel, we have that rule. Can you see how this angle is equal to that angle, is equal to that angle, is equal to that angle? Okay? So, if this angle is 49 degrees, this is 49 degrees, this is 49 degrees, and this is 49 degrees. So these are all acute angles there. Now, think about this. This supplementary angle here has to be the same as this since you got 49 on each side of that transversal. Likewise, if we go underneath, this supplementary angle has to be equal to this one, which is equal to the top supplementary angles because they all have 49 as their supplement. So the big uh, obtuse angles are also equal, okay? All right? All right. So right here is what I just said. These obtuse angles are equal also. Okay? So let's see what that looks like. Aha! Uh -huh. So, equal acute angles. Now, acute is less than 90 degrees. Less than 90, 1. Less than 90, 4, 5, Eight. One, four, five, eight. Now, can you see how those all would be the same number of degrees? They're all equal because the two red lines are parallel. Okay? Meanwhile, our obtuse angles are all equal here. Okay? And that's two, three, six, and seven. Ah, now watch this. Angle one, angle one is 60 degrees. Okay, angle one is 60. So that's what the test says. And then it says, find all these others. Okay, now watch this. Supplementary, one and two equal 180. So two must be 120 degrees because 120 and 60 is 180. Okay, so 2 is 120. Now, 2 is the same as, let's see, 3. Oh, watch this. 3 has to be 120 also, because watch, watch of this. Now the transversal is the supplementary line. We got 60 here, so 3 has to be 120 to go 180. So 3 is 120. Now, if 1 is 60, then all these acute ones, uh, I'm sorry, all, all these acute ones are also 60. So 4, 5, and 8. Uh, 5, 60. And then 7 is a big obtuse supplementary angle, so that's 120. Okay? All right. Now, down here. Oh, well, let's look how easy this is. Okay. First, we want to know angle A. Well, it's 180. 
180 minus that 50. So A is 130 degrees. Okay. Now, same thing here. Look at that. B must be 130 because now we go, there's the supplement. Okay. Now, remember how the obtuse angle is equal? So D is 130, just like A and B. D is 130, okay? Now, if this angle is 50, then this acute angle is also 50. Then let's see what E is. E is also acute, 50 degrees. Notice how those add up to 180, okay? Okay, we'll start from the bottom here. Okay, once again, we're only given one. LE, angle E, is equal to 40. Now that means all of these other ones are 40. Okay, you notice how this and this are what? Vertical angles, so they're e equal. So E and H are 40, E and H are 40 and A and D are 40. Now, let's make it easy on us. Watch this. This is 180 degrees. So F is 180 minus 40 is 140. So the oblong, or I'm sorry, the obtuse angles are all 140. Okay, obtuse is F and G. 140, 140, notice that, 180, notice that, 180. Now B and C, those are obtuse, and those are the same as these two obtuse, 140, 140. And those equal 180 each, okay? All right, now let's go up to the middle one, okay? Once again, we're only given one. Angle 8 is 76. Angle 8 is 76 okay whoops I blew that one 76 I'm thinking angle 7 is 76 degrees oh goodness okay 76 degrees now 8 is 180 minus 76 is 104 degrees okay now watch this this angle is vertical to this, so 5 is also 104. And then with a transversal, these obtuse are equal to these, so that's 1 and 4 are 104. Okay, then 7 and 6 are vertical angles, so they're equal. So 7 and 6 are 76, and then these same two are the same as those. Okay. Now, last but not least, right up here. Okay. So, whoa, do we get a little fancy here? Okay. The we're not given any clues as to what their exact uh, uh, degrees are, but what we are given is a a is x and c is two x. See, see here? Now, x plus 2x is equal to 180 degrees. Well, let's say x is like a dollar and 2x is two dollars. What's one dollar plus two dollars? It's three dollars. Let's, let, let, let's just say. Now, we've learned, we've learned to do that. So each x is 60. Now, go, go back here. If x is 60, what's 2 times 60? 120. Does 60 and 120 add up to 180? Yes. And is 120 double that of 60, just like 2x and x? Yes. So a is 60. c is 120. Together they add up to 180. Now, b is vertical to c, so b is 120 and D is vertical to A, and D is 60. Then each of these up here are 120, 
and each of the acutes are 60. And we'll go ahead and end that one for here.